All right, everybody, welcome out here to Holiday Racing Season 7, Event Number 9. For the first time in five events, the Orange Track is back for two events. So let's see how this will change up the game this weekend as we're happy to be back out here on this track. And let's go ahead and get this event started out here with not just Gabe and Earthshaker Ice versus Monster Jam California in Northern Nightmare. Earthshaker is definitely going down the, down the ramp, but Northern, but he will spin out in Northern Nightmare. We'll get Next up, we've got Monster Jam Kobe and Prancer versus Nicole Johnson and Tasmanian Devil. Tasmanian Devil has a new axle on this truck as the tires were a bit wobbly. So let's see how that will affect the truck and see if she can have your side. It says Mini Devil's going really fast. Go we'll hit the Jersey Barriers and Prancer will get the win. Next up, we've got Cats and Dasher versus Karen in Blue Thunder Ice. Blue Thunder Ice has the lead. I don't know what or happened with Dasher, but Blue Thunder Ice will get the win and move on. Next up, we've got Bullseye and Roger Dodger versus Lizard Gaming and Avenger. Avenger has a lead. Avenger going right into the Jingle Bells and will hit the wall, and which will allow for Roger Dodger to get the Next ball. up, we've got SpongeBob SquarePants and SpongeBob Monster Truck versus Sheldon J. Plankton in Plankton Monster Truck. And this is a battle between two of these SpongeBob character trucks, and they battle between the Krusty Krab and the Chum Bucket. Who will get the win? When they play the Krusty Krab going against the owner of the Chum Bucket in Plankton's disc. Plankton's has been struggling out here this year, so he's gonna get another round one loss in Spongebob. Ooh. Next up, we've got Squilliam Fancy Sun in Octinator Ice versus Racket at 17 in Stone Crusher. Stone Crusher also got a new axle, kind of just like Tasmanian Devil in Stone Crusher. And with the new axle, is gonna get the win and move on and defeat Squilliam. Fancy. Next up, we've got Monster Jam Collector 2008 Northern Nightmare Ice versus Scrap in Prowler. Ooh, tiles there kind of messing up Northern Nightmare Ice and Prowler will get the win. Next up, we've got Nicholas Moore, Kesey, and Grave Digger Ice versus Gary the Snail and Monster Mutt Ice. Ooh, they both got into a spin out and a turnaround and Monster Mutt Ice will get the win. And Next up, we've got Mockware 001 and Bigfoot versus Bubble Buddy in Mohawk Warrior. Mockware has the lead. He kind of got his whirly though. It's a bit close. I can't see what's happening when it's happening, but Bigfoot will get the win in it. And that's going to be another round of loss for Bubble Buddy. That may hurt him in the top five. He may fall out of the top five with this Next loss. up, we've got the Cameron 9785 in Monster Mutt versus Larry Lobster and Crustacean. Even going down the way, but oh, can Monster Mutt get the win in reverse? Oh, that is close, but I believe Monster Mutt will barely. Well, if the wind in reverse, the crustacean didn't crash, he may have had a shot to get Next the win. Next up, we have Sandy Cheeks and El Toro Loco versus Eugene H. Krabs and Mr. Krabs Monster Truck. Ooh, that is close right there. there but Mr. Krabs has also been having a lot of hard luck this year, and El Toro Loco will move Next on. Next up, we've got Liam's Toy Time in 32 Degrees versus Miguel Duanez and Ice Cream Man. Man has a bit of a lead, but 32 degrees with a block will get the win, and Ice Cream Man couldn't quite push past Next it. up, we have Zona Monsters and Bad Company Ice versus Squidward Q Tentacles and Squidward Monster Truck. Squidward's got a big lead going down the ramp, and Squidward will get the win. And Next up, we've got Jonas and Blue Thunder versus BuckFan23 and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Ooh, Blue Thunder with the Jersey Bears, which will cost him, and Buck Fan 2013 Mutant Ninja Turtles will get the win as he keeps going, and with one of the farthest passes so far of the afternoon. Next up, we've got Twin Monkey and Holiday Hauler versus Mum and Yeti. Holiday Hauler is slightly going down the ramp at first, but will spin out, and Yeti will do him with like a flat spin off the Jersey Bears. Next up, we've got win. Monster Jam Weekly Updates and Dragon versus Mrs. Puff in Higher Education. Ooh, that's a crazy, right, crazy crash from both of the competitors. That was a wild race, but Dragon will get the win. Next up, we've got Kayla Blood in Soldier Fortune Ice versus Sandra Colney in Snowhawk. Snowhawk getting all swirling going down the race lane, and 
Sanders' bad luck is just going to continue out here as Soldier of Fortune Ice will Next move up, we've got Nathaniel Evans in Moss Martel Mission Ice versus Mac Bulldog Mac in Alien Invasion Ice. Ooh, Nathaniel just hits the jingle bells, just pushes Mac Bulldog Mac out of his way, and Nathaniel Evans and Moss Martel Mission will Next move up, on. we've got SpongeBob Fan 23 in 2020 Christmas Stunt Truck versus Caro Harrison in Dragon Ice. Ooh, I somehow crash, but I get the win in my good luck streak continues as I take down Caro Next Harrison. Next up, we've got us underscore jam and dancer versus Spin Master Monster Jam in Santa's Monster Slay. We've got one of the reindeer versus Santa. Who will get the win? Ooh, Santa's Monster Slay had a great start, but will crash and... Dancer will move on to the next round. Next up, we've got Patrick Star and Patrick Monster Truck versus the Chocolate Drive and Mechanical Mischief. Patrick has the lead. Can, uh, oh, Mechanical Mischief just could not get the win with the crash, and Patrick will move on. Next up, we've got Maxer RT and El Toro Loco Ice versus Moss Truck Sid and Walmart Museum Truck. Big like turn right there in a donut and he hits reverse. Nice job from Monster Truck Sid as he'll get the win in the Fidel Toro Loco. Next up, we've got Rigs of Rods, SMTV, and Glaze Machine versus Flying Dutchman and Track Ace Tires Grave Digger. Track Ace Tires is bigger as a lead. Oh, and he will get the win in reverse with a nice donut and a drift. Wow, great job for Track Ace Tires Grave Digger. Next up, we've got Nitro Studios and Son of a Digger versus. Perch Perkins in Chillin' Villain. Chillin' Villain getting some big speed out of that. Chillin' Villain could get the win. Maybe if he wouldn't win straight, he could have gotten it. But Son of a Digger will get the win. And Next up, on. we've got Birdo Trevino and Monster Mart Rottweiler versus Monster Jam Extreme in Vixen. Birdo, oh, it looks like Extreme is going to crash right there. The aerodynamics of the Ranger are not working out for him as Monster Mart Rottweiler will Next up, we've got Jackson Hughes and Grave Digger versus Dead Panda and Captain's Curse. This is the final race out here in round one. Who will move on to round number two? And even... Oh, Captain's Curse will crash on the Jersey Bears, and Grave Digger will move on. It is now time to kick off round two with Bakugan Dragonoid Monster Jam Fan and Bakugan Dragonoid Ice versus Monster Jam California in Northern Nightmare. Oh, Dragonoid Ice trying to get the block, but Northern Nightmare will push past. Next up, we've got Monster Jam Kobe and Prancer versus Karen in Blue Thunder Ice. Blue Thunder Ice has a big lead, but Blue Thunder Ice will spin out and Prancer will keep it straight to get the win. Next up, we've got Bullseye and Roger Dodger versus SpongeBob SquarePants and SpongeBob Monster Truck. Roger Dodger has the lead. They'll both hit the jingle bells, but Roger Dodger will crash and SpongeBob will get the win. Next up, we've got Rack Edit 17 and Stone Crusher versus Scrap and Prowler. Ooh, Stonecrush is going a bit slow out here, going down the ramp, which is going to cost them, and Prowler is going to get the Next win. up, we've got Kitty Witty and Monster Mutt Husky versus Gary the Snail and Monster Mutt Ice. It's a battle of the dogs out here. Which one will move on? We're supposed to going out the way, but Gary will spin out. Kitty Witty hits a slap wheelie, almost looks like... Off the Jersey Barriers or the wall, and that will be enough to get him the win. Next up, we've got Mockware 001 and Bigfoot versus the Cameron 9785 in Monster Mutt. We're close going down that race lane, but Monster Mutt with the Jersey Bears and Bigfoot will get the win. Next up, we've got Aaron 1234 Channel and Team Hot Wheels Firestorm versus Sandy Cheeks and El Toro Loco. Team Hot Wheels Firestorm may have had the lead game. Sandy try to take down the season leader in reverse. Oh, Ooh. still wants to push them out of the way, but it's not going to work out. Team Hot Wheels Firestorm will Next get Next up, we've got Liam's Toy Time in 32 Degrees versus Squidward Q Tentacles and Squidward Monster Truck. Squidward has time to the lead. Liam's Toy Time with a rare mistake of spinning out. And Squidward will get a really, he got all crooked in that pass, but... He's going to send out making all the way to the umbrellas to get the Next win. Next up, we've got Mermaid Man and Iron Man versus Buckfan23 and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. 
Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles will have a spin out and Iron Man will get the win. Next up we've got Mom and Yeti versus Monster Jam Weekly Updates in Dragon. Dragon, they will both hit the Jersey Bears, but Yeti will finish ahead to get the win. Next up, we've got Kayla Blood in Soldier Fortune Ice versus Nathaniel Evans in Monster Mud Dalmatian Ice. Ooh, it looks like Dalmatian Ice with the Jersey Bears, which will allow for Soldier Fortune Ice. Next up, we've got SpongeBob Fan 23 and 2020 Christmas Stunt Truck versus Us Underscore Jam and Dancer. Ooh, and nice little walk for Dancer will get the win and defeat me as it looks like my streak of making it all the way to round three is over. Next up, we've got All About Monster Trucks and Michigan Ice Monster versus Patrick Starr and Patrick Monster Truck. Patrick has a lead, but Patrick will spin out and Michigan Ice Monster will get hit the jingle bells to get the Next win. Next up, we've got Monster Truck Stadium Walmart Museum Truck versus Flying Dutchman and Track Ace Tires Grave Digger. This is a rematch from the final round in the first event in event one. So let's see who will come out on top and get the win. Track has a huge lead. Maybe if Mostrickson could have kept it straight, he could have gotten the win, but having an aggressive hit on the jingle bells, Track East Stars Grave Digger will get the Next win. Next up, we've got Barnacle Boy and Batman versus Nitro Dot Studios in Son of a Digger. Son of a Digger. Even going down the ramp of Batman with the Jersey Bears and Son of a Digger will get the win. Next up, we have Birdo Trevino and Monster Mutt Rottweiler versus Jackson Hughes in Grave Digger. This is the final race out here in round two. Who will advance on to round three? The Rottweiler may have a slightly going down the ramp. Can Rottweiler get a win? No, get the win? No. Grave Digger will. Get the win in reverse and move on to round three. All right, everybody, it's now time to kick off round three out here with Northern Nightmare versus Prancer. Prancer has lead. Prancer with a block will get the win and defeat Northern Next Nightmare. Next up, we've got SpongeBob Monster Truck versus Prowler. Ooh, Prowler can get the win in reverse and SpongeBob will move Next on. Next up, we've got Monster Mutt Husky versus Bigfoot. And Bigfoot came off the ramp weirdly. Oh, Bigfoot making a comeback. And Bigfoot will get the win and defeat Monster Money. Next up, we've got Aaron. We got Team Hot Wheels Firestorm versus Squidward Monster Truck. Oh, Squidward at the Jersey Bears and Team Hot Wheels Firestorm will just casually revert, put it in reverse and pass Squidward. Next up, we've got Iron Man versus Yeti. Yeti with one of the fastest passes yet. Something got to go weird when she was going down the ramp and she just took off and she's going to get the win and defeat Iron Man. We've got Soldier of Fortune Ice versus Dancer. Ooh, Soldier of Fortune Ice really tried really hard to get that win. We'll just hit that barrier and Dancer will go to the quarterfinal. Next up, we have Michigan Ice Monster versus Track East Tires Grave Digger. Nitro Dot has a huge lead to hit those jingle bells and wipe out to get the win and defeat Michigan Ice Monster. Next up, we've got Son of a Digger versus Grave Digger. The Battle of the Diggers out here. Who will get the win and advance on to the quarterfinals as this is the final race in round three. We were supposed to going down the straightway. Grave Digger pushing Son of a Digger out of the way as Grave Digger will move on. All right, everybody, we're now in the quarterfinals. Here are our, our eight quarterfinalists. Inside of Prancer, we have Monster Jam Kobe. Inside of SpongeBob Monster Truck, we've got SpongeBob SquarePants. Inside of Bigfoot, we've got Mawkward 001. Inside of Team Hot Wheels Firestorm, we've got Aaron 1234 Channel. Inside of Yeti, we have Mum. Inside of Dancer, we have Us Underscore Jam. Inside of Tracky Sarah's Grave Digger, we have Flying Dutchman. And inside of Gravedigger, we have Jackson Hughes, who will go to the semifinals. Will it be Monster Jam Kobe or will it be SpongeBob SquarePants? SpongeBob has a big lead. Monster Jam Kobe crashes. SpongeBob also crashes and gets on his roof, but SpongeBob SquarePants will go to the semifinals. We'll go to the semifinals. Will it be Mockware 001 or will it be Aaron 1234 Channel? Oh, Aaron 1234 Channel with an excellent 
excellent bounce off the Jersey Bears, but it's not going to be enough. Mock Warrior 001 advances to the semifinals. Who will go to the semifinals? Will it be Mum or will it be us underscore jam? Mum has a huge lead, crazy crash out there by us underscore jam, and Mum will get the win. Who will go to the semifinals? Will it be Flying Dutchman or will it be Jackson Hughes? This is the final race of the quarterfinals. Who will advance to the semis? Jackson Hughes up this. It's a battle of the Grave Diggers. Oh, if Jackson Hughes did not the Jersey Bears. He could have gotten the win, but it's just not going to work out as the Flying Dutchman will go to the semifinals. It is time for the semifinals. Here are, here are our, our four semifinalists. We've got SpongeBob SquarePants, Mockware 001, Mum, and Flying Dutchman. Who will go to the final round? Will it be SpongeBob SquarePants or will it be Mohawk Warrior 001? SpongeBob getting a bit tripped up, he hits the jingle bells, and Mohawk Warrior 001 will advance to the finals. Who will go to the semi final? Who will go to the final round? Will it be Mum or Flying Dutchman? Winner takes off, faces off against Mohawk Warrior 001. Dutchman has a huge lead, hits the jingle bells with a loud crash, but somebody will finally be able to upset him as Mom will go to the final round. Holiday, Monster, Holiday Racing fans, we've made it to the final round out here in Holiday Racing Season 7, Event Number 9. We started off the afternoon with 58 of the fastest holiday themed monster trucks and we're now down to the fastest too holiday racing fans are you ready to meet our final round contenders coming out first out of okeechobee florida trying to get his second event win here on the season representing the oldest monster truck the one that started it all this is mohawk warrior 001 in bigfoot Versus in the other lane out of Tampa, Florida, looking for her first event win on the season. This is Mum in Yeti. Who will get the win and the next 58 points here on the board? Let's find out. It's showtime. Oh, Mum with the jeans. Jersey Bears and Mohawk Warriors are one makes up ass all the way. I believe he hit the podium right there, but great job by Mohawk Warriors are one on his second event win of the season. He's been doing so well this year. Pick up another event win. He's going for that top five spot. So, you know, great job by Mohawk Warriors are one. You know, today's been a bit of a tough day for him. Sadly, you know, he was going to go to a monster truck show. Summer out there, but sadly, just it just couldn't happen. So this definitely cheered him up. So great job, out of from Walker Zero Zero One on this win, and he'll get the next fifty-eight points here on the board. All right, everybody. Here are the results out here after Holiday Racing Season Seven Event Number Nine. Sure was a crazy event for our first orange track event since last weekend. Let's take a closer look here at the top five. In fifth place, after a after getting the event and win out here, it's going to be Mohawk Warrior 001 and Bigfoot. Wow, great job, Mohawk Warrior 001, one of my best friends out there. Congratulations on making it in the top five. He's been working so hard all season long to get this spot, and now he finally has it. It's a great job out here for Mohawk Warriors 001 for climbing into the top five in fifth place with 385 points. Fourth place after losing in round two will be Liam's Toy Time in 32 degrees with 394 points. Third place after making it all the way into, um, let's see, after making it all the way into round three, Will be Kitty Witty and Monster Mutt Husky with 400 points. Second place, after making it all the way to the semifinals, is going to be Flying Dutchman and Track A Stars Great Digger, 403 points. 
Then your points leader in fourth in first place with 431 points after making it all the way, I believe, to the quarterfinals is gonna be none other than Aaron1234 channel in Team Hot Wheels Firestorm with 431 points. Currently right now looking at this at these points right now, it looks like uh, you know, Team Hot Wheels Firestorm has a pretty decent lead here over Track Ace Sarah's Grave Digger, but the way how Track Ace performs on this track, um, you know, he could easily catch up. So Aaron's gotta stay on their A game if they're gonna try to keep this season lead heading into the, the next five ground track events. And then, you know, we have a lot of trucks right now. We have a first three trucks and our top three have now entered into the 400 points. We have a lot of trucks entering into the 300 points. And we also have a lot of trucks in the 200 points as well as some few stragglers still with under, with still with 100, still in the 100 points range. So yeah, it's definitely been interesting out here and we cannot wait for our next Orange Track event out here tomorrow on Sunday for Holiday Racing Season season 7, event number 10. So everybody, please be sure to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so this means be notified for when event 10 comes out. Alrighty, bye-bye, everybody. Have a God-blessed day, and we'll see you all soon for some more Holiday Racing action. Peace out.